Queen Latifah reporting to you from my Sony studio at my show. I was born as Diana Owens in New Jersey and signed to Tommy Boy Records in 1989. My music usually contains hip-hop, jazz, and gospel, and has the elements of R&B, soul, and dance. It wasn't easy being black, getting respect for being a black woman in the music industry. I became the first female hip-hop recording artist to get nominated for an Oscar. I was also an actor and premiered in many movies, including Life Support, Ice Age, Living Single, Juice, and my very own autobiography, Ladies First. And if you didn't go watch my movies, you should go watch it right now. Of course, after the show, because you don't want to miss what's coming up. But anyways, enough about myself. We'll be back after this commercial break. With all rules to the rebel youth who grow with the gusto for adventure. They're imaginary, like boundaries in infinite space. The building begins from within, then out of skin onto pavements where you pave the way. From corner store conversations to revolutionary contemplating, it takes training. It requires heart to acquire an absence of fear. This ain't no hocus pocus, you can become potent when your potential is embraced. And your focus causes you to become colorblind to color lines, seeing that there is no mold. The model for the future is for you to make new. So spark the rebellion. Do it with cause. The power to change your surroundings is right here in your palms. Go out and pound the pavements. Pulverize any paradigms and leave no standard standing. For success isn't intended to be the possession of a select few. Don't ever let them see you sweat. Just be bold be true. In honor of Black History Month, I have brought a very special guest. She came all the way from Liberia to come speak about her life as a black female leader. Please welcome the president of Liberia, Ellen Johnson Sirleaf. Yes, thank you for having me on your show. I'm so excited to be here. Wow, you don't look a day over 30. Oh, stop it. They don't lie when they say black don't crack. Okay, so tell me about yourself. Not everyone knows who you are. Um, I am the president of Liberia. I am 75 years old. <laughs> <laughs> I was the first woman democratically elected as the head of state in Africa. I was awarded the $5 million Abraham Prize for Achievement in African Leadership for Transformative Leadership in the Aftermath of Liberia's Civil War. Okay. So, where'd you grow up and what colleges did you attend? Well, I was born in Monrovia, Liberia. I spent most of my years there. I studied at the College of West Africa before moving to the U.S. Then I went to Harvard University. University of Wisconsin, Madison, and Wisconsin School of Business. Wow, so you had a very productive college career. Oh yes. It wasn't always easy, but you always have to work hard for what you want. Am I right? <laughs> yes. So how is being a president like? When did you take office? In 2005, I stood for president as the candidate of the Unity Party in the 2005 general election. Then in 2006, I won the 2005 presidential election and took office on the 16th of January, 2006. Being a president is not as easy as it seems. There are a lot of lives that depend on me and count on me to better the nation. But even through all the hardships, I try my hardest and I never give up. Okay. So what are some hardships that you came across during your presidency? Well, I was in office when Ebola broke out. I was faulted for my handling of the Ebola epidemic, and my country still remains one of the world's poorest. 
My country didn't want a black woman as a leader. I was even chosen to be replaced by a soccer player. A soccer player. <laughs> George Weah and Vice President Joseph Boke in a presidential runoff. So as a black woman myself, we all have hardships and we just have to, you know, work harder to prove everyone wrong. Right? Yes, very much. And I'm sure we're proving them wrong, after all. <laughs> On that note, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for having me. Round of applause. Shirley. <laughs> she had to get up and push. wait no. Johnson Shirley. All the way from Liberia to come speak about her. <laughs> they over 30. Oh stop it. <laughs> I missed my part. <laughs> you could have kept laughing and just worked away. You are. As you all may know. I am the president of Liberia. I am 75 years old. <coughs> Restart that. That took so in Africa. I was awarded the five million bill. Ooh. <laughs> and what colleges did you attend? Damn it. My heart is and never give up. So Turn. as a black woman leader. Whoa. So as Wait. a black woman. <laughs> I don't know how to end this. On that note, thank you so much for having so <laughs>